Um, if you're coming from Windows, um, you have NTSF format, and uh, when you plug in your external drives, you, you might have something like like this message. I really don't know how to um, mount it any other way except for manually. So that's what we're gonna do today: manually mount the drives. Uh, and the first thing you want to do is um, make a folder uh, in terminal. And to do that, all you gotta do is um, open the terminal and just type in uh, sudo mkdir. That means make directory or make folder. And in the path, you wanna put it in uh, your media slash, and then the name of the folder. Mine will be Bankai. Um, try not to use space in your folder. It makes it more easier. So yeah, so you make folder and push enter to tell you type of password, and and you're done with that, All right? <coughs> the reason for doing that in terminal is because um, you cannot do it manually like this. You know, you go to the media folder here, and then you try to make a folder. They ain't gonna fucking let you. So that's why. <coughs> and then after you make the folder, um, you also have to use the terminal. To find um, your mount, uh, your drives, and to do that, you have to use uh, the fdisk command. You have to type in sudo fdisk um, dash l. That's an l, not a one. And when you see you enter, you see something like this, right? See, I have different drives, right? Right here, like all the mounted drives. But I know my external one is. Um, 500 gigs, right? 500 GBs. So I know this is mine, right? And so the device is pointing to um, the see device SED. That's my device. However, um, <coughs> that's not my partition though. My partition will be um, right here SED5. I mean SDE5. And that's my partition. See NTSF right here. So yeah, um, that's what we're looking for though when we're using this command. And after you do that, um, you will want to uh, mount the drives. And to mount it, uh, you use sudo mount um, slash device slash SDE5 because that's where we got it from here and uh, where we want to mount it to the folder that we just made right this is media slash bankai that's the folder we wanted it to stay at and after that we execute by pushing enter and uh, it's done right and to know that it's done um, all you gotta do is open the folder again and you see now we can access it See all my all my folders are in here. It's working, <coughs> right? So we know it works. And if you want to unmount it, um, you know when uh, you need to take it or somewhere or something, take it out. All you gotta do is uh, type in um, sudo umount slash uh, device slash um, the partition that we use. Uh, it might change every time when you connect it in your computer, but you, know, you just use the fdisk command to um, to find out um, the new uh, partition uh, name that they give. That's it. that's just how you do it. And then when you unmount it, right, like that, and now it's unmounted. So we go back to our folder, see if it's unmounted, right? See, and now it's blank because it is nothing in there. We unmounted it. So that's how you, you um, mount um, an external drive or some drives that is not working um, manually. That's all.